I'm Christine. I'm a PhD researcher in the lab of neurobiology where we investigate amyotrophic lateral sclerosis or ALS in short. ALS is a devastating neurodegenerative disorder that targets the motor neurons that connect our brain with our muscles. When these cells are lost due to the disease, uh, ALS patients get wheelchair bound and get more difficulties with eating, speaking, moving and so unfortunately patients will pass away typically within two to five years after they get their diagnosis. There is no cure available and this really underlines the urgent need for new therapeutic strategies for ALS. Oxidative stress, uh, metabolic dysfunction and neuroinflammation are three of the main hallmarks of ALS. And this pointed us towards a new target for ALS, which is named Eglin2, and which is unique for its role because it plays a central role in cellular energy metabolism and the inflammatory response. In the lab of Professor Carmelit, where they investigate cancer-related angiogenesis, they already found that inhibition of Eglin2 protects different cell types against oxidative stress. We found that targeting Eglin2 in ALS zebrafish and mice protected their motor neurons and mitigated their ALS phenotype. Moreover, we used single nuclear RNA sequencing together with the single cell and the nucleomics core unit to identify the cell-specific pathways that underlie these beneficial effects. So here we're in the stem cell lab where we culture patient-derived astrocytes, which are the helper cells of our neurons in the central nervous system. And so using these cells together with the single cell approach, we found that targeting Eglin2 normalizes the inflammatory signaling in these cells. So together we identified Eglin2 as an ALS target that protects motor neurons in different ALS models and found that it normalizes the inflammatory cascade in astrocytes in ALS mice and patient cells.